Hello fellow Sudokans and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Wednesday the 13th of November 2024. I hope you are keeping well and enjoying yourself as best you can. It's quite. Uh, um, it's not that early in the morning, actually it's just kind of morning I guess. Uh, here in Bangkok the sun is shining. I've been out to get breakfast but haven't eaten it yet. So I shall play this game of Sudoku first. Um... I'll be able to eat the breakfast um, in an air-conditioned room, which is great for me, and not too worried about having to face blackouts, which is certainly a problem for many people in various countries. Um, in particular, one problem is uh, in Ecuador, where they have been handling blackouts uh, for a long time now. Um, they have power cuts. Uh, from 4 till 11 and then 3 till 10 and they get around 4 hours of electricity a day in some places in Ecuador. Uh, this is really unfortunate and um, part of the problem really uh, is the fact that they have invested so heavily in uh, hydro power, hydroelectric power. Um, now this is uh, uh, you know, a, an environmentally less uh, damaging form of power to the when it comes to carbon emissions, although of course building the dams themselves are often environmentally fraught with damage. But anyway, um, the problem is uh, that climate change is causing changes to rain level, uh, the, the levels of rain and when it rains, etc., etc., etc. And um, problematically, they have had droughts in Ecuador for quite some time, and this has lowered the levels in the uh, reservoirs and so uh, unable to produce the power to get the uh, electro, electro power working. In fact they have up, up to 70 percent of their electricity through uh, uh, hydroelectric power so this is a really difficult situation for them. There have been demonstrations in Quito, the capital, uh, against the uh, power cut so our sympathies are with the people as always and uh, hatred is with those people who are polluting the environment to such an extent and want to continue polluting it to make the situation even worse. Let's get on with the game of Sudoku, shall we? This is the Guardian's medium level puzzle for Wednesday. Remember, the pattern is Monday easy, um, Tuesday and Wednesday medium, Thursday, Friday hard and Saturday expert. It's always the same weekly pattern. So we're going to start with threes blocking up, up and across here, giving me our first digit here. Um. Okay, I think we've got fives across, across here and down and up there, so we'll get five in that square. Uh, we'll keep going across like this. Now we've got twos across and now we've only got one blank square possible for the two. Six blocking up here and six across here will give us six here. And we'll continue with those sixes because we can get another one up there and another one over here. quite seem to have much energy. Yesterday I was not feeling very well. Uh, I'd kind of overexerted myself the day before, I think, and uh, came over feeling really tired, a kind of exhaustion. Um, it could have been because of the sunshine as well, I suppose. I did quite a lot of walking in the sun as well as out of the sun. And uh, today I'm not sure how I feel, but anyway, I'm playing Sudoku, so that's a start. 
And I think I'm going to have to go through the digits bit by bit to see what I can see. down and up four across here we'll put four into one of these two squares blocking down four across here and four across here says that this has to be a four and then the four from up here blocking down and the four across there, come on, will give us four in that square. And four across here, across here, and down there. Actually, I've just realized, I said four in those squares. I've just realized I could have, uh, my eyes are just weird. I seem to be missing so much stuff recently. Four, uh, there's still a four to get up there. That's done. I hear some music in the background. I don't think the microphone will be picking it up, though. It's too quiet, but it's a uh, very old-fashioned time music. Okay, seven to the end and seven up here, but we also realized that seven's got to be in one of these three squares, so that can't be seven. Seven's got to be there. Eight blocking up here puts an eight into this square, eight across here and there, gives us an eight there. Um, so the one blocking here puts one into one of these squares so that means one and eight are here and one and eight are here so that means these squares have to be one and eight what else does it mean it means five blocking across here will give us five in that square and if this is one and eight this has to be uh, two nine yeah because that's two nine down there um, two nine so that's got to be one or eight as well one eight one eight one eight And the two blocking across here and two across there will give us two in that square. Obviously, I'm not rushing the game. I'm not in a big rush mood today. Don't need to hurry. Uh, if I do have any work, it's going to be in the evening. And so no need to whiz along. Six. 
7 blocking across here puts 7 into one of these two squares, so 7 blocking up here, right? Uh, up here, I should say. And then 7 is going to have to be in one of these two squares, so that can't be 7, so that's got to be a 7 there. And now we just have digit 9 to finish this column. 9 across and down here puts 9 into one of these two places, so 9 across, 9 across for a 9 in that cell. 9 blocking up here gives us a 9 here. And we know this is 1 and 8. Uh, left down here then is going to be 2 and 6, so we've got 2 blocking there, so that's the 2 and that's the 6. Two blocking down here and across there for a two in this square, two this way, two that way. And there's a two, two up to the top here. Gives us two up there and finally we get our nine down at the bottom here. We also have nine blocking across here, so I am now I have put seven in actually let's do this now, seven there. So now 7 and 9 both block this square. That's 7 and 9 there. This has to be a 3. And the last number to place over here is a 7. We have 7s across and across. So there's 7 there. Three blocking down puts 3 in this square. This is a 1. One blocking up here gives us a 1 there. nine blocking across here for a nine and this is going to be an eight and the missing number here is a one eight is in this square here eight across there gives us eight in this square nine blocking up there puts nine here and a one in this square Uh, this is 1 and 3, so down here this can't be 1 or 3. It's a 6. 6 across here, put 6 into that square, which is the last digit, 6. 5 blocking down to the bottom, so this is a 5. Here's a 1. One more number left for this column. 9, 9 across here, there's a 9, and this is going to be a 7, 7 across there, there's a 7, here's a 1, 1 back this way, there's a 1, last number, here's a 3, 3 across here, puts 3 in that square, 5 finishes the game, so a typical straightforward medium game from the guardian will i be back with other games of sudoku today i don't know actually i'm not suddenly since i started playing this i'm feeling rather um hot <laughs> and bothered so i'm not sure uh, if i'll be back later but hopefully i'll be back with some more sudoku if i feel up to it later bye bye